the body's largest organ, the skin, serves as a protective coat, guarding internal structures from the outside environment. It is composed of two distinct layers of tissue, the epidermis and the dermis. The epidermis consists of an outer sheet of dead cells called the stratum corneum, and a deeper section of rapidly dividing cells called the basal layer. When dead cells of the stratum corneum are damaged or scraped off during body activity, cells from the basal layer rise to replace them. The epidermis serves as the body's initial barrier to invading foreign substances. Directly below the basal layer is the thicker dermis layer, made of dense connective tissue. Embedded within the dermis are several kinds of important sensory receptors, including thermoreceptors, which detect temperature change, Meissner's corpuscles, which are sensitive to touch, and free nerve endings, which detect pain and tissue damage. The dermis also contains many other structures, including sweat glands, hair follicles, and blood vessels. Dermis layer, made of dense connective tissue. Embedded within the dermis are several kinds of important sensory receptors, the epidermis and the dermis. The epidermis consists of an outer sheet of dead cells called the stratum corneum, and a deeper section of rapidly dividing cells called the basal layer. When dead cells of the stratum corneum are damaged or scraped off during body activity, cells from the basal layer rise to replace the body's largest organ, the skin, serves as a protective coat guarding internal structures from the outside environment. It is composed of two distinct layers of tissue. Them. The epidermis serves as the body's initial barrier to invading foreign substances. Directly below the basal layer is the thicker dermis.